Hello, hello! Welcome back to part three of Murder of Sonic the Hedgehog. We are picking up right where we left off last time by going into the next part of the game. So, yeah. <laughs> Don't want to stay around and look at all the great books? Yeah, normally yes, but the mystery calls. Investigation continues. Being heavy, I'll tell what I need. There you are, Rouge. I have a lot to say to you. Visited every train car so far and ever and said they've seen you wandering about. It's high time you told us why. Talk about a warm up. What to the point are you? So you brought the microwave master with keys. That's nice. <laughs> Please don't let that be my legacy. Yeah, that sucks. Uh, tells the right pucks have been brought up. Probably up a lot. I care to explain? Tell him Rouge need to help. Blaze. I think for a treasure room to be stored here on the train. Certainly didn't tell me about any treasure in the interview. Part, since I'm part business acumen, part purveyor of fine collectibles, I knew I had to find it. Tell them what it is, Rouge. Well, alright. It's a Fabergé chow egg? Hmm. That's not extravagant. Please don't tell me you accepted Amy's birthday invite only to find that egg. Woman can have full goals. Even her birthday present already, so everything's well taken care of. She wrote me in on the hunt immediately. I stayed here while she searched the train car for clues. Today, so the Fabergé chow egg is here in this train car, locked in a safe. The treasure's real. <laughs> Actually, here was it like a fucking prize for winning at all the casino games or something. What'd you find, Rouge? Both take a look. Two three zero four zero one. Train's blueprint. Every car with the safe cover in the score of a lifetime. Train's blueprints. Finest keepers. Uh, there's a problem with persistence. What kind of problem? The elevator behind the security guard leads. They're employing the Fabergé Chow Agna. Well, the guard's access card. We had to plan to get that card. The elevator in our this cruise. Everyone's help. So if you steal a Fabergé egg, yeah. I don't think that's gonna happen. The problem with this? Yeah, Blaze, you don't have a problem with us stealing stuff? See no issues here. Sounds like a fine business venture. <laughs> her little card must be influencing her decisions here. Maybe without a break in the rules must be refreshing for a princess. Mm -hmm. Do you have an opinion on this? Stealing is for squares. It's time for a five-year discount. Uh, probably shouldn't, because that'd get me fired. But I don't know. Some I'm pretty sure I can't actually continue the game without choosing to help these lovely ladies. Both plays and cool here in. Let's get that Fabergé Chow Egg. Let's take it. Yeah, we're both on the team. Nice plan. What have I got myself into? Yeah, that's a good question. Who's behind the Chow Locked Elevator? There Security guard has been access card. Do we attack the guard, bribe the guard, and then distract him would be the smartest thing. Charming enough to work. That was actually a really nice thing to say. Aw. Never seen you smile like that. <laughs> eh. If someone like Rouge told me I was attractive, I'd be happy to, so. Seems they don't know how to take a compliment. Nope. Don't know how to take a compliment at all. <laughs> I'm being in a casino, my poker face needs to work. Eh. He's distracting the security guards. Ugh. I would probably be distracted by Rouge though, so I don't know if the security guard would. Tails might be able to come up with a decent out excuse for why he needs to distract him though. Like the way you said that, Vito. 
because it's a little shaky. Alright, prepare off elsewhere. Alright, who we choose? Uh, okay, so tells us no. Rouge? Alright, then, you resist my feminine charms. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure how effective your charms would be on a chow. Plus, your flight might be useful. I'm not sure being the distraction makes sense. Fair enough, let's think of it. Okay, so then it's Blaze. You distract me. In my life, I've never a single person down. I won't falter. Great. So stoic, I have chills. Moving on. What's the distraction? Uh, claw machine stuck. Push a bunch of poker chips to the floor. Ask the child about their partner and kids. Mm. Yeah, they probably just redirect that to one of the robots. That might work, pushing the chips over. Uh, depending on how chatty they are, they might have a shit ton to say about their partner and kids, so... Eh? Talking about themselves, easily distract the guard. Alright. Move on then. Get access to the card. Oh. Grab them and fly up to the rafters. Just pick their pocket. You did a pretty good job picking the conductor's pocket for that $20 bill he had, for God's sakes. You know, problem that chow and form won't notice a thing. Try not to take anything else from them if you can help it. No promises. Yeah. With the carb chain, we need to get Blaze out of there. What's my plan? Uh, let's see, there's a drink with coaster, pushes the security guard over. Pretend you're Blaze's spouse. Uh, maybe? Come here. To the royal. Hey. It's your heritage. Any more crimes I should know about? No. Playing in complete refashioning immediately. Maybe we should try something else. Okay. Far too easily as well. Work on your fortitude. So much <laughs> Alright. Cartoons. Uh. I don't think that would do anything. Push him over? Well, any violence. Okay, so. Ah. Cry so easily a security guard. Well, let's think something else. So there's a drink without a coaster, as silly as that is. Think of nothing worse. Alright. Spick well, I've never allowed such a thing in my game. Go running immediately, I'm sure of it. Here we go. Into the elevator. The celebratory dance, pasta and apple cider, sing victory a cappella. Eh, apple cider sounds good to me. And one last security. Here we didn't account for. What do we do about the mechanical arms attacking from the ceiling? High <laughs> five each of them. Tell disabled them tight in one big knot and have tells disabled them. Need some time. Uh at least for our next question. Tell is taking oh uh, arms are tightening their grip. Cry and hope they sympathize. Imagine you're not in pain. Uh Pretend there's nothing wrong? So, yeah, this plan is perfect. Well, it's ready, it's time to execute. Okay, let's begin. Let's up that, that elf here, oh boy. <laughs> ah, yes, a flawlessly executed plan that we don't get to see. <laughs> plan went off without a hitch. Could have made. It this far without the uh, my gratitude. Very thorough, I must admit. It was executed to perfection. Then our pride, hip care, and these blueprints. Alright. Treasure. And the code on the blueprints to find out. 2304. I don't believe that was what it was, but whatever. Fancy. Four, two, let's get out of here. 
the hasty there is thing. No further secrets for sure. Pretty sure spit it out, what are you hiding? Only three of these eggs were ever made, each in their own individual secret. No one knows the secret because one who one has never lived to tell the tale. No. Nope. Well, everyone is to its secret. I don't know if you should. All you need to do is twist it. Yeah, it's a bomb. Great. Uh oh. No one looks. It's because each egg is a bomb. I think you're on something. <laughs> Sounds like a bomb. I suppose that egg right now. Hard work. Fine, but what do we do? Where do we put it back in the safe? Uh. Da -da -da. We're unlocking in the safe. Safe won't lock the door. Stink. Obviously, but there must be some weird way to relock the door. No. Under dials, I'm supposed to think of something else. Uh. Iron. Taking to see what happens. Tell the egg to stop. Bruce kiss the egg. He has to control the egg away. I can't do that. Egg upside down. Stomp the egg. Smash the egg against the wall. Open it up. See there's wires to cut. Take one for the team. <laughs> Twist the egg again. Toss the egg in the elevator. The egg. Uh, toss it in the elevator? We're clearly not going to blow up the elevator. Let's rethink this. <laughs> Damn it. Uh, open it up, see if there's any wires. You know, red wire, blue wire, you gotta cut one, like the movies. This isn't a movie, this is real life. It's kind of a good point. Alright, fine, smash it against the wall! <laughs> you have a different plan. Let it finish taking and see what happens. <laughs> Blow up. Our goal. What if the egg isn't a bomb? What if it's an egg timer? This video did say something interesting about the train's manual. Extremely accurate technology installed to keeping the train spotless. During events, from a variety of tasks responsible for cleaning up trash and Afterward. And also, take weapons and explosives being brought onto the train, ensuring passenger safety. Those robot arms that attack the no seem on function here on the train. The bomb is brought onto the train disguised as a fiberty egg. <sighs> the arms would have detected and wouldn't have allowed on. The person who is coming and going on the train is the conductor, and he surely wouldn't allow such a thing either. So if we're out of options, I think we should wait and see what happens. Okay, we wait. Okay. And it's hollow, not a bomb at all. We were on to something. Oh, well, that's one get the heart racing. Completely relieved. <laughs> My hunch was right, thankfully. Look what's inside. A little shallow necklace. It's so heavy too. Final secret to the Fabergé Chow Egg is a chow covered in gems. Perfect, it's exquisite, it's revolutionary. It's fucking gaudy if you ask me, but whatever. <laughs> She's rolling over a sparkling ornament. Yeah, yeah that, that's rouge. Always hankering for more gemstones. But I must admit it is stunning. No, it's not. Said so no one lived to tell the Fabergé Chow secret. I wonder if the egg wasn't a bomb. They weren't as tough as us. I don't know who cares. What a precious treasure for you to behold. Maybe they naturally died of old age and just kept a secret with them. As much as this has been, we 
here before we're spotted. Good call. Let's go. Uh, Lordy. Oh, that was silly and fun. No one seems to suspect anything. The security guard is back at their post. Hope they subdued the drink coaster fiend, okay? Need both of your assistance. That home is extreme. Exactly the thrill I was seeking. Oh, you're welcome, ladies. Still was strangely fun. But I preferred to never do it again. Now Rouge. Believes horde of bedazzled chow. <laughs> what is it? Oh. Uh, oh, those blueprints. Now that you're done with them, maybe we could take a look. Well, I appreciate your assistance. It said finders keepers on me. No longer. In case I missed any other treasure, but I promise to let you take a peek later. Sound grateful, but I get it. You can't just add sweetheart to the end of a sentence to make things better. I don't think there's any reason why her. She's more powerful than me. <laughs> Truly, she is a domineering woman. <laughs> Alright, well, out of your way for now then. Murder mystery to attend to. Shall get me in reach one of these. Passed through earlier. Okay. Key to the next car. Lock the door so you can continue forward. You know, we've had a lot of people mention your age, but also much suspicion about Shadow. He's unpredictable. Good luck to you. <laughs> no. Good luck, but you stay safe. Thanks again. Alright. Mystery continues. Uh, give it a good arm to fight the attack arm faster and we see them. Can't help but wonder how they're controlled. Chucker was ordering around a bit earlier. At the very least, things are pretty much smoother than them here. And, uh, very versatile. Must search the trash bin. It's empty. Oh. Is they hear an O? Believed in thorough investigation, even peeking at trash. Persistent cells. Told me. Then when you met my mother, he would drive to her for two hours away every day with a flower from his garden. She quickly agreed to a date, and when she arrived, the start she found two dozen roses waiting for her. Within a year or two, very about caring, dedication, and persistence. Very sweet, but I've been as a lollipop stick. A lollipop stick? Never stick from a lot of probably that's what's in there. You need <laughs> Just leave me be. Leave me alone. Damn it, we'll find that Pokeball in the trash soon. I know it. Falling off that heist was much more enjoyable than these casino games. And what's your ally, madam? You need to begin murder mystery, what did you do? Down a car, refill. So I had to talk about the Fabergé Chow egg. All can talk to the casino car. Then we our separate ways. I scoped around and discovered the egg was there. Without a play with the slot machine, the train the sudden jolt with odd. Didn't leave the car. Gave Amy her present when she stopped by. Shadow passed. So, brief. Gave him the eggs a key and left. Alright. So to prove you're here playing the slots. I do actually, I kept winning, so I saved the cash out voucher. You can take a look. It's here. 14,000! Fuck! How did you. I'm just naturally lucky, I suppose. Mm. She's so self aware. Oh, well, thank you for your time, Blaze. You tell Karen I said hi, won't you? Oh, that's nice. Fuck. 14,000. Hmm. Robotnik chips, what the fuck? Segman's logo, I suppose. Feels a lot of casino, well, yeah. He ends like Casino Nights and on all that other stuff, so. And it's always caused trouble for us in Sonic. Your poke chip I've at least seen has Eggman's smug on it, so I'm not too surprised to see this here. So I shouldn't be so surprised, but. Mm -hmm. How about you, Rouge? You got anything to say? Thanks for the help. What can I do for you, darlings? What's your alibi? You can cover up. Maybe you got the murder mystery. What did you do? Sammy paired the police lab. I immediately ripped her in. Fabricated egg hunt. 
pulling up at the casino car and I went searching for the blueprints. See, so yeah, I went back through the library, slim cars till I found the library car. See Sonic at all during your search? No, I so. I remember him. Dining car at the beginning. Do you have anything to support your claim? Please don't be poking around blueprints on me. Hardly had time to chase Sonic down, murder him, and find these blueprints myself. Appreciate you answering our questions. Take care. Can I play the slot machines? Yeah, let's play one. Oh, I'll have to try again. No, we're gonna move on from the slots. <laughs> uh, let's see. I love the table. I love casino instructor. But I've never so we sat down to play for one. Yeah, let's play some blackjack. I don't know how to play that. It's easy, let me show you. Oh, we simply don't have time for this. Must have been Sonic. Probably a good point. Ah, fine. Blackjack's easy. All you have to do is get as close to 21 without going over. And then you win. Alright. Alright. Yeah, let's find Shadow. It was a little faster than I thought it was, so maybe doing whatever with Shadow will take a little longer. Lounge car. That was as good a time as any to clean my pockets. I know exactly why I've been locking those doors. It's hard to get a word you talk over me. My reasons. No reason is convincing enough. It's an See what you did. What's going on? So you made it here too. <laughs> Expect the Iron Chef as well. We'll see what you say when microwave chili dogs are delicious. Mm -hmm. I'd also like to know what you've been locking doors throughout the train, Shadow. Seems Amy already knows, so ask her. I'm not saying a thing, you tell me what. Hey. No. Believe me, B, I have an appointment coming up. Wants to meet with him. Make sure I wasn't going to talk with some investigating. Find some answers. Is there a reason you want to open this? What if something falls out or worse, someone leaps out? I just think you should do it. <laughs> Alright. Heck, cough, cough, cack. It's fucking dusty as hell. We were too fast, it blew everywhere. Full screen. It's gotta activate something. Back of the wardrobe opened. Full passage way back here. Come on, we have to see what's leads. To Narnia! Curious, this must mean something big. Huh, it's a shortcut to the library. That's neat. I don't believe it. Back through the passage before they spot us. <laughs> we need to add that to our inventory. Hidden passage to your inventory. Yep. What about you, Amy? You got anything to tell us? I have caught up. It's probably six long to get here. I thought you wanted to save Sonic. We've been thorough. Do you have any clues for us? Just a hot tip, but I will be revealed in due time. I think I'll be shedding a bit. It's a whole case. I hear sharing is caring. Journal report Amy Rose is first to reveal a scoop. When you're ready to challenge Shadow, talk to them. You're ready. Here's what it is. She seems confident. Hold you to it. And talking would just make her repeat what she said. You want a scoop of the century. I can feel it. Another robot arm just doing its thing. Employee, do you have any power over these arms? Can you tell to do something? No, but I'll give it a shot. Hey, Robot Carm, can you... 
Give me a high five. Doesn't seem to be listening to you. But I can give you a high five. Oh, sweet. <laughs> Big chow band. Play us a ditty. Now, oh, is that it? I don't miss. Well, let's chow understand music. How about a jam? <laughs> That was spiritual. <laughs> Feel reawakened. Let's see. Anything else? Uh, hmm. A pair of keys. Be shadow of the locksmiths. Trying there's only two keys. The feared locksmith will have a bunch. Want to take it? Yeah, let's take it. <laughs> Printer. Computer. Print something. Sonic singing a song. Sonic rowing a boat. Surprisingly tricky to use. Tricky. Your interface isn't very clear, but I won't slip me. <laughs> and here we go. Exactly what I asked for. Why this this pack on the printer? Yeah. How about rowing a boat? I think I remember which button to press. It's really that complicated. Have you ever had a printer work when you wanted it to? Yes, unfortunately, I have to use one on a regular basis every night at work. <laughs> Getting chased by a shark, that's pretty good. Look like a charm. Why did I set this back on the printer? Alright. Hmm. Uh, what's in the trash? No. Check the trash bin. <laughs> I'm disappointed every time. Are you going to get... Again, if there's nothing in the trash bin. There's always something in the trash bins. What's this? Ha ha ha! Crumpled paper, yes! <laughs> it's on the front page of the Tika website for the band Hot Honey. Hmm. One of Amy's favorite bands. Here's what it is. Let's add it to our inventory. Are we sure this isn't just trash? Only oh, have yeah, this. Always success if you check the trash bins. Uh, I think we found enough clues. Let's go interrogate Shadow and find out what really happened. But there's still two more things to click on. Told us about this in the interview. The lounge has a computer complete with access for casual browsing. Standard business center slash convenience for guests. Well, it seems convenient. And be on the computer and missing these gorgeous views though. I feel like you're using the computer. You must really use it. Yeah. Not exactly the most convenient thing, frankly. Visiting Big Chow Band. Take a beat. Visit Music Planet Zone. Music Plant Zone, not Planet. And what's the view like outside? Oh, that's very lovely. Big fishing. Huge, what a view. Didn't realize the train drive along the coast. Just want to hop out and take a dip in the ocean. This train wasn't so nice to be on, I'd agree. Despite the murder lingering in the air. Despite the murder lingering in the air. I just thought the same thing. Alright, I believe that's everything. Can't move on until they tear your shadow. Yeah. You can bet hit it myself. Yes, you were. Oof, better get back to the mission. Okay. And I was just making sure there wasn't something back there, like back in the library. Nothing I help either of you. I ask you to leave me be. It's so cold. You know, maybe we'll get out of here, actually. It certainly will not. Start interrogation. Get out, I'm busy. I have an appointment to attend to. Or this is important. You've questioned on the strain, and every single person has mentioned running into you. You've been locking every door on the strain, and now I know why. Pray tell, why was I locking all the doors? No, my hot tip. Everyone's ready for a scoop found by yours truly. We're ready. 
Next car is the conductor's car where Sonic was the station. This door right here, the lounge car, is the only door that leads to the conductor's car following. So Shadow is locking all the doors for one, one reason alone, to keep Sonic from escaping the conductor's car. Do they think Shadow was trapping Sonic? Locked the conductor's car, unlocked all, or so, wasn't suspicious. Pure conjecture. You'll get out, leave me be. Source can, Source can back up these claims, though, are in anonymous, but I think the point stands. My source claims they never saw Sonic again after they went to the conductor's car. Why? Because he was trapped and couldn't leave the conductor's car. Reckless speculation. Does the logic sound, though, with Shadow trapping Sonic? I'll play along and follow the train of logic, Amy. Shadow did lock the door to the conductor's imprisoning Sonic. Then how is Sonic found in the dining car? Exactly. I think Colby and I can explain the car change, however. Hmm? What evidence do you have? You know that shit. Sonic could have gotten to the dining car. A secret passage. That's gonna be a bit. Oops. Didn't hit the jump button fast enough. bad at this. Jesus, that's a lot. Do I just have to do this perfectly? No, oh, that's kind of BS. I could have had it too if I'd done that. Damn it. 
Damn it. Probably just screwed me up right there. Oh god, yeah. Ugh. Holy hell. After this, I'll have to call this recording here because this is getting on like nearly 40 minutes. I don't want half this thing to be me just failing. <laughs> well. back at, with, uh, at this in the next episode. <laughs> uh, so, uh, sorry to cut it off right here in the middle of me attempting to do this, but like I said, I don't want this to be like nearly an hour long and half of what I'm doing is just failing miserably at this. So, thank you for watching. Stay safe. Uh, we'll see you next time where hopefully I'll beat this relatively quickly and we can continue on with more in the next game or in the next episode, I mean. All right, later.